Welcome back to our channel Drupal Academy. In today's video, we will be discussing what is hook underscore preprocess underscore block function in a Drupal and how can we pass the variable from our module or dot theme file to the block tweak template. So first I will explain you about what is the hook underscore preprocess underscore block. It is a Drupal function that allows developer to make targeted changes before the block is rendered. We will learn how to use hook underscore preprocess underscore block and how can we use this to make the required changes in our block. Before going into the hook underscore preprocess block, it is important to know what are the blocks in a Drupal. So blocks are an individual piece of content that can be placed in a specific region on a page. So like here you can see here this is the header block. After that we have the content block and at the end we have the footer block. You can check that block structure into the block layout. So here you can see we have the uh, multiple blocks like site branding block bread comes in the content region we have the page title tab sales and uh, in the footer region we don't have any block now we got the understanding about what are the blocks now it's time to start using the hook underscore preprocess underscore block function so this function allows you to target specific block and make changes to their content structure or behavior you can use it to add custom CSS or JavaScript, change the HTML markup or even create entirely new block programmatically. In the next slide, we will see the one example how to pass the variable from our not module or the theme file to the block tweak template. So using the hook underscore preprocess underscore block function, we can pass the variable from our dot module file. So I have this custom model hello world and I will pass the one variable from this hello world model to the this block tweak template system branding block HTML. So if you inspect this you will get the name of the block where you can see right now the block system branding hyphen block HTML. Now we will pass one variable from our dot module file hello world dot module this is the hello world is the module name and you can use the same function in your dot theme file as well inside your custom theme so for this example we will use hello underscore world dot module and in this file we will write the hook and we will pass the variable to our the block tweak template system branding block so let's start First I will write the comment. Implements hook underscore reprocess underscore block. Now I will write the function. Function we need to replace the hook with our custom model name or the theme name I will replace this hook with my mock custom model hello underscore world so this function accept the one reference variable that is the variables before passing the variable I will show you uh, by printing this array what data this array contains I'll copy this and write the dump paste here save the file and again go to your page and refresh the page so here you can see that variable contains the different types of values like element attributes and the plugin id so this is the block id right now we just want to pass that variable to the our system branding block so we will add one condition 
that if block plugin id is equal to this then only pass the variable then if you check the another block its block id is page title blocks next is the system main block so we will write the condition if dollar variables plugin id equal to copy the name from here we will create the one variable and in that we will pass the value dollar variable this will be our custom variable and we will assign value like this is custom variable value now save the file and print this variable inside the this block system branding block template I will print that variable just below the this block we, we print the variables in a tweak template like as double curly bracket opening and closing and paste the variable save the file and again refresh the page so here you can see we have successfully passed the value from our dot model file using the hook underscore preprocess underscore block function in this function we have checked if the that block id is equal to system branding block then create one variable custom variable and assign that value and we have printed this variable in our tweak template like this way in the conclusion hook underscore preprocess block is an important function for drupal developers and site builders by understanding its potential and following the best practices you can use it to create more dynamic user friendly sites that meets your clients needs so that's it from this video i hope this video is useful for you if you have any question or need any further assistance feel free to leave a comment below and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more drupal tutorials thank you for watching and see you in the next video